I'm Kent Justice in the Channel 4 studios. Jacksonville police are looking at the death of a child. It happened in the Dunn's Crossing subdivision on the northwest side on Tuesday. A child drowned in a retention pond. It's near the intersection of Johns Creek Circle and Robert Masters Boulevard. People in the neighborhood have been talking to us and tell us that it was a four-year-old girl who was taken away and eventually pronounced dead at the hospital. At the Nassau Duval County line, one person died in a mobile home fire. Jacksonville Fire Rescue saying that there were heavy flames showing when they got to that home on Blyler Road off Lanny Road. That was just before 7 p.m. on Tuesday. And a gas leak in Jacksonville Beach for several businesses to evacuate. The leak was fixed by about 7.30 on Tuesday night, but a portion of First Street North were told to be closed until sometime on Wednesday. And some of the people trying to enjoy a final trip to Campeche Bay a restaurant. They had to turn back because of the gas leak. Those stories and many more available to you right now on news4jacks.com.